popular Russia. We have prepared for you a selection of interesting Russian science fiction movies. Dark Planet is a two-part Russian science fiction film directed by Fyodor Bondarchuk. The film was adapted by Marina and Sergei Dyachenko from the 1969 novel by Arkady and Boris Strugatsky, of the same Russian name, published in English as Prisoners of Power, a part of the Noon Universe series. It is a dystopian story set on post-apocalyptic planet Sereksh, ruled by a totalitarian regime that brainwashes its citizens. Maxim Kammer, a space explorer from Earth, crash lands on Sereksh and becomes involved in the planet's everboiling politics. The movie was released as two separate films in December 2008 and April 2009, respectively. The film was met with mixed reviews. It was praised for its visual style, social commentary and being faithful to the original novel, but also criticized for its direction, editing, and casting. Dark Planet was made with one of the largest budgets for Russian cinema at the time, it remains the most expensive Russian science fiction film ever. Guardians is a 2017 Russian superhero film, directed by Russian-Armenian filmmaker, Sarek Andrusyan. The film tells the story of a team of Soviet superheroes created during the Cold War. The team includes representatives of the different nationalities of the USSR. Each of the protagonist's superpowers reflect the strengths and traditions of the people of the USSR. During the Cold War, an organization called Patriot created a superhero squad, which includes members of multiple Soviet republics. For years, the heroes had to hide their identities, but in hard times they must show themselves again. Calculator, Russian 2014 fantasy feature film. Calculator takes place in the distant future. Ten prisoners condemned to exile on a hostile planet XT-59 must pave the way through swamp to reach the islands of happiness, the only safe area on the planet, before the harsh climate or the underground horrors kill them all. Coma is a Russian science fiction action film directed by Nikita Arginov. It was released on January 30, 2020. After a mysterious accident, a young architect comes back to his senses in a very odd world. He must find out the exact laws and regulations of it while he fights for his life and keeps looking for an exit to the real world. This world is based on the memories of the ones who live in it, people who are currently finding themselves in a deep coma. Human memory is spotty, chaotic and unstable. The same as the coma odd collection of memories and recollection cities, glaciers and rivers can all be found in one room. All the laws of physics can be broken. The architect must find out the exact laws and regulations of coma as he fights for his life, meets the love of his life, and keeps on looking for the exit to the real world, which he will have to get acquainted with all over again after the experience of coma. Project Gemini is a 2022 Russian science fiction thriller film about a space mission sent to terraform a distant planet. However, the mission encounters something unknown that has its own plan for the planet. In the not-too-distant future, mankind has made huge advances in its explorations of the cosmos, establishing scientific stations on many planets. Some time has passed before one day, a group of astrophysicists receive a mysterious signal from space. It seems to originate on a remote and as yet uncharted planet. The signal creates dangerous irregularities in the Earth's environment. An expedition is made to the planet itself in order to locate the source of the signal. A small group of people, the vanguard of humanity, sets off into the unknown. They must endure dramatic and even tragic events to save the Earth from this dire threat. Attraction is a 2017 Russian science fiction action film. The plot focuses upon an extraterrestrial spaceship crash landing in the Chernovo district of Moscow. The Russian government immediately implements martial law, as local civilians grow increasingly angry at their unwelcome guest. Man's first contact with aliens does not go as expected. 
an unidentified object appears in the sky over Moscow, ending in catastrophe. This new threat unites humanity, forcing them to forget about recent conflicts. While the authorities try to figure out what kind of creatures they are dealing with, our protagonist, who has lost her friend, sneaks into the restricted zone. She is the first to meet the enemy face to face, only to realize how wrong we were. Cosmobile, also known as Goalkeeper of the Galaxy, is a 2020 Russian superhero space opera film based on the animated series Galactic Football. The film is set in the future, a post-apocalyptic city in a world inhabited by survivors of an intergalactic war that has shifted the planet's poles. 2071. Galactic wars have destroyed the moon and changed the climate on the Earth. Now tropical forests are covering Moscow, while New York is iced all over. A huge alien ship towers over Moscow, it is the stadium where spectacular intergalactic cosmobile competitions take place. The game combines both sport and gladiator fights. When the game is on, the whole world stops in its tracks to watch it. The players are called athletes, only they are allowed to contest because of their powers and ability to control them. Everyone adores Cosmobile except Anton, a regular guy who wants to find a job to help his family. But once he reveals his powers and gets to the world's Cosmobile team, now he's one of the athletes. Anton has no idea what special role is destined for him and that the final game will become the battle for the Earth. Mafia. The Game of Survival is a 2016 Russian science fiction action film directed by Sarek Andrzejewski and written by Andrei Gavrilov. It was inspired by a popular party game, Mafia. Moscow, 2072. The card game Mafia became the most popular television show in the world. Eleven people gather at the table to find out who are innocent civilians and who is ruthless mafia. The world is going to see a cocktail of emotions and feelings. Fear, lie, pain, pride, passion, love and death. The winner will receive a huge cash prize and the loser will just die. Invasion, also known as Attraction 2, is a 2020 Russian science fiction action film. The action of the film unfolds after the events described in Attraction. With the fall of the alien ship Julia's life changed, now three years later mankind is about to experience new encounter. The action takes place three years after the events of Attraction. Julia, who was saved from death with the help of extraterrestrial technologies, has unusual abilities now. The girl has become the object of the research conducted in secret laboratories of the Ministry of Defense. Julia's new abilities attract not only people on Earth, they are becoming a threat to extraterrestrial civilizations, because of that the Earth is threatened with invasion. Heakin is back to save her. This time with the help of Sol. Sputnik is a 2020 Russian science fiction horror film directed by Igor Abramenko in his feature directorial debut. USSR, 1983. At the height of the Cold War, a Soviet spacecraft crash lands after a mission gone awry, leaving the commander as its only survivor. After a renowned Russian psychologist is brought in to evaluate the commander's mental state, it becomes clear that something dangerous may have come back to Earth with him. In a secret laboratory situated in a military base closed off from the rest of the country, Nerofashulogist tries her best to save the cosmonaut from the alien monster. Meanwhile, she discovers that she feels much more than just a professional interest in her patient. Popular Russia